Mr Speaker, can I remind the Prime Minister that last week, before the Liaison Committee, he admitted testing currently has huge problems. Dido Harding said we plainly don't have enough testing capacity. The Health Secretary said fixing testing would take weeks. Pretending there isn't a problem is part of the problem, Prime Minister. It's unclear, and let's test, let's test what the Prime Minister's explanation is. Is it the explanation for the problems that we haven't got enough capacity? The problem, the pro it says which problem? The problem that he acknowledged one week ago before the Liaison Committee. Mr Speaker, is the explanation from the Prime Minister that we haven't got enough capacity because nobody could have expected the rise in demand? That's the Dido Harding defence. Or is it we've got all the capacity we need, it's just that people are being unreasonable in asking for tests? That's the Hancock defence. So which is it? Uh, Mr Speaker, I must say I think that the continual attacks by the opposition on, on, Di on, Dido, on Dido Harding in particular are, 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 unseemly, are unseemly and unjustified. And I think that, she, and I think that her teams... Her teams have done an outstanding job in recruiting people from a standing up. This is not for a moment to deny the, the, uh, to deny the anxiety of those who want tests, which I readily accept. Of course, of course, we would love to have uh, much more testing instantly. And, and it is thanks to the efforts of uh, NHS Test and Trace uh, that we are not only at a record high today, uh, testing more people than any other European country. But uh, to get to the point that he raised, Mr Speaker, we're going to go up to 500,000 tests by the end of October. That is, that is the work of Dido Harding and her team. And I think, actually, again, you know, what, what we want to hear, and what I frankly want to hear, is more of the spirit of togetherness that we had yesterday, Mr Speaker. Because, because this is... This is an opportunity to support NHS test and trace. This is an opportunity to get behind that scheme, to encourage people to believe in it and its, in its efficacy. Instead, he constantly knocks it from the sidelines, Mr Speaker.